Together with uh, local and international partners, we are running a two-year project to strengthen academic publishing in Tanzania. And in order to do so, we've created a consortium of academic publishers here, commercial publishers and university publishers, so they can exchange knowledge on academic publishing. So far, it's been a challenging and exciting journey. The knowledge sharing we do in our workshops will hopefully create a better organized publishing industry in Tanzania. I feel it's a duty in life to give back to others. I feel really privileged to be here with Tanzanian scientists and learn what is important to them. I know I've been fortunate with my education and I want to share my enthusiasm with scientists here so they feel empowered to step up and share their findings with the rest of the world. Because I think they deserve it. The science here is worth spreading to the rest of the world. We are here today at Makuki Nanyota Publishers to talk with its owner, Walter Bogoya, about how we can enhance a reading and publishing culture here within Tanzania. We have this idea that only with Western standards is science possible. This is not correct. I think science is possible wherever people are looking for solutions to their problems. Science is content and content can be expressed in any language. The link between reading and the science is that the two go together. And more people have to read. People are not reading sufficiently. Books haven't been accessible. People haven't been introduced to reading when they're young. So that is a habit that has to develop. I'm very much interested in journal publishing. I'm very pleased that we have got this uh, consortium of uh, uh, academic publishers. I think it's an excellent idea. It brings us together so that we can pool resources, we can have training of people in different areas of publishing, and uh, set our own standards. There are now 20 universities in Tanzania and many more are coming. Every university wants to do two or three journals. The resources don't really permit. My point is this, what you want is to produce material that enhances the reputation of a university or a collection of universities. So if, for example, three universities do one very good political science journal, and then other universities do a very good agricultural journal, or uh, I don't know, any other journal, that would be much better. Tanzania is a proud nation with a huge potential to be an example for science development in Eastern Africa. I'm convinced that embedding a reading culture in Tanzania will really help advance the nation as a whole.